Hi, I'm Martin Niper. I'm about to enter Cape Buffalo with a bow and arrow. So I hope you enjoyed. So we woke up at 4 a.m. Um, and we, we set out and we kind of got on high ground. We glassed the bottoms and eventually uh, right at the back section of the property we found uh, two lone bulls up this valley. And uh, as we were planning to stalk, uh, they started actually moving down the valley. So we kicked off our shoes and uh, we, we planned to cut them off. Everything was going to plan but as they were about 40 yards away we could hear the bushes breaking and uh, they were feeding and they actually started splitting up they were actually one was going to come to our left and one to our right we were hiding behind this big bush and uh, the wind switched and uh, the right inside bull smelt us as the wind dropped went straight to it and uh, they bust off and uh, yeah we didn't see them again for quite a while We put in another stalk again and on the last minute the wind switched as I was about to shoot. So with this, uh, you know, thinking they'd be worked up a little bit, we decided to back off for a few hours and give them some time to relax. hours later we set up off um, the same mountain again more or less opposite in the direction where they ran and uh, we actually found them out again feeding uh, down this little draw that was quite thick and uh, by this time luckily the wind had sort of reached a more constant direction and uh, we stalked up the draw and uh, decided to cut them off again and uh, within half an hour or so they came feeding past us And uh, the bull I was after turned and presented a shot and uh, he was ever so slightly quartering towards me so I decided to shoot him through the shoulder. Um, and uh, I got very good penetration considering as I had to shoot through about 9 inches of muscle and crystal. The arrow went straight through a rib and then lodged in the opposite rib and uh, yeah he actually went about 100 yards and uh, expired so i was very happy with the equipment and uh, the hunt worked out perfectly so the buffalo bull's busy going down we're just giving him some time he ran about 120 yards but the shot was excellent and uh, now we just gotta wait for him to go down so with a shot, nice old Tucker boy. Yeah, he's bleeding heavily. Yeah. <laughs> nice, there he lies. One arrow cape buffalo. We got a nice old buffalo bull here. Um, I just want to thank uh, Marius Potrida for backing me up and uh, for Krista Kraus for hosting us on this hunt. And thank you, Hanko, behind the camera. You did a superb job. And uh, yeah, you had to keep our composure and kept your composure and everything worked out. Thanks very much, guys. Yeah, thanks, Martin. Well done. Beautiful old bull. Real old dagger boy. Well done. Dead, dead, dead. This Mazi certainly whooped him. So on the hunt I used a Matthews Monster bow uh, which I've had for a number of years and I uh, actually kept it for an occasion like this 
um, I use 850 grain um, weighted carbon core hardcore arrows with 200 grain um, muzzy phantoms and uh, yeah the equipment performed flawlessly and the buffalo went down within 100 yards.